With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello students. Question is, the value of limit x tends to 0 sin alpha x minus sin beta x upon e to the power alpha x minus e to the power beta x equals. So let's solve this problem. So in this question, what I am going to do? I am going to add 1 and subtract 1 in this denominator. So this question will become limit x tends to 0 sin alpha x minus sin beta x upon e to the power alpha x minus e to the power beta x plus 1 minus 1 okay now what i will do see i will give this one to beta x in denominator okay so this will become and minus 1 to e to the power alpha x so first of all we will write e to the power alpha x minus 1 in one bracket and in from both this term, I will take minus common. So this will become e to the power beta x minus 1. And in numerator, this will be sine alpha x, okay, minus sine beta x. What is our next step? See, I am going to divide whole numerator by x and whole denominator by x. And we'll separate this division. So we'll get this. Okay. Now, see one formula. Limit x tends to zero sine x upon x is equals to one, which means that if both the term is same, and at this limit both tends to 0 then value is 1 here see this is alpha x this is x there is no alpha so i am going to multiply alpha alpha in denominator and numerator and here beta okay now i am going to write another formula limit x tends to 0 e to the power x minus 1 upon x is equals to 1. What is concept in this formula? See, the degree in e and denominator both should be same and this should be minus and this should be 1. Then this value is 1 and at this limit, this term and this term both should tend to 0. Now see, in degree this is alpha x, so I am going to multiply and divide alpha. And here this is beta x, so I am going to multiply and divide beta. Okay, now we can write the answer. See, this is according to our formula this, and this is also according to our formula this. Both limit will become 1, so alpha into 1 will become alpha minus beta into 1 will become beta upon this will become 1 for this formula and this will also become 1 according to this formula. So 1 into alpha will become alpha minus 1 into beta will become beta and this both will get cancelled out. Okay. And this will become 1 answer. Okay. Thank you, students. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.